Let's move on and briefly discuss vitamin C. Immune cells actively participate in eliminating pathogens such as bacteria or viruses from the body. Vitamin C is highly concentrated in immune cells with neutrophils and leukocytes having 50 to 100 times higher vitamin C concentrations than plasma, where it serves as a potent antioxidant. One of the early stages of the body's immune response to viral or bacterial infection involves neutrophil infiltration into an infected tissue, where the cells engulf pathogens and initiate their removal. Neutrophils generate large quantities of reactive oxygen species, but the high levels of vitamin C present in the immune cells protect them from reactive oxygen species induced DNA damage, while also promoting neutrophil function, including reactive oxygen species production. Studies in humans have also shown that vitamin C supplementation can enhance neutrophil function in young men between the ages of 18 and 30 years, as well as in older women, average age of around 72 years. Vitamin C also appears to boost the immune system by promoting the proliferation of T cells and preventing T cell death. T cells play a major role in driving an immune response against pathogens such as bacteria or viruses. Vitamin C also participates in the production of interferon in mice. Interferon is a type of cytokine that signals the body to initiate antiviral defenses. To learn more about the role of vitamin C in common colds and other aspects of human health, please listen or view our podcast on vitamin C. You can find that at foundmyfitness.com forward slash episodes.